Mercedes should have signed Lando Norris to replace Lewis Hamilton, not George Russell. According to a former F1 driver, Mercedes driver George Russell has opened up on his team's lack of pace this week. Russell believes that much of the 2022 Mercedes car's issues relate to its problems with bouncing, also known as porpoising, as the ride height of the car needs to be raised to control this phenomenon. He said this week that Mercedes can raise the car very high to potentially solve the issue, adding it could help find a huge chunk of lap time. He added, it's all well and good saying that, but we can't physically achieve that right now. So we need to have a rethink. The former Williams man is under pressure to prove his worth in his debut season for the Silver Arrows. Given Mercedes' dominance in recent years, taking on one of their two seats is a place many drivers would love to find themselves in. While Russell showed brilliant pace at Williams last season, Mercedes were told in January that they should have signed Lando Norris instead. Jack Nichols said on the F1, checkered flag podcast at the time, if I'm Mercedes and I have a free choice in that second seat alongside Hamilton, I think I'm picking Norris over Russell after this year. Former F1 driver Jolian Palmer added, I'm going with Jack on it, I'm going with Lando, the way that he held off Lewis Hamilton at the end of that Sochi race until the strategy and the tire choice got away from him, was unbelievable, for a guy that has never won a race, to have a seven-time world champion breathing down his neck in a Mercedes. Then it starts raining, and he's still off the road a couple of times, scrabbling around, but keeping Hamilton, we all know how good he is in the wet, behind him. It was really legendary stuff I think from Norris, Norris all but ended any chance of him making a move to Mercedes when he committed himself to McLaren last May, the young driver's deal keeps him in the papaya of McLaren until 2025. Upon announcing the deal, Norris said, I'm really pleased to have extended my relationship with McLaren from 2022, having been with the team for almost five years, I feel very much part of the family here and I couldn't imagine starting the next phase of my career anywhere else, McLaren has been a huge support since my days in junior series and I've really enjoyed learning and developing as a driver since. My commitment to McLaren is clear, my goal is to win races and become Formula One world champion and I want to do that with this team.